It is February 8th, 2017. And coming out of nowhere, Winter Storm Nico, severe weather alert for the entire U.S. Northeast Coast. Temperatures set to drop up to 40 degrees overnight and bringing possibly 8 to 12 inches of snow in a matter of hours. I was just checking out a weather report on Fox News and I was actually checking weather conditions about eight hours ago and I heard absolutely nothing about this storm. And as I had expressed before, we're going to continue to have these very, very weird weather patterns. I mean, today it was 52 degrees where I live, when in fact it should have been about 25. And in New York City today, it was 60 degrees when it should be about the same thing, anywhere from 25 to 32 degrees. So bottom line, folks, our weather patterns are changing drastically. And as you can see during this weather alert update, how drastic these changes are going to become. Now, after this winter storm goes through the Northeast, approximately 48 hours later, we'll be right back in the springtime. So let's take a listen to this report. Fox Extreme Weather Alert, millions and millions of us in the Northeast bracing for what could be the biggest snowstorm of the season. Winter storm warnings in effect now from southern New England down through Delaware along the I-95 corridor. Forecasters say some of us could see blizzard conditions for a while. Right now it sure feels like spring in the Northeast. 51 in Boston, low 60s in New York, 66 in Philly, 67 in Baltimore, 69 in D.C. Forecasters say lows tomorrow could be 40 degrees colder. They report the storm could dump up to a foot of snow in some places and the worst of it could come right in time for the morning commute. Here's the good timing. Chief Meteorologist Rick Reichmuth is here. Not, not a, a, a historic storm, but bigger than anything we've seen. Yeah, because this year really hasn't had a whole lot of snow just yet. Yeah. But uh, we're about to get it, kind of the first one. And because it's going to fall in kind of such a short time frame, that's going to be the big problem. Take a look at the temps, though, as you were saying, Chef. 60 degrees in New York. The, the good part about this is you have a day to get ready for what's about <laughs> to come. Go out and get your milk, all those things that, that people like to do. But take a look at these temperature things. We're 23 mm. degrees above where we were yesterday in New York, 27 degrees lower than you were yesterday in Cleveland. So we're in this kind of a seesaw pattern here, and it's a uh, it's all about to change. How much snow are we talking about? So we're going to see a lot of people that probably get in the 6 to 10 inches, and there will be a few spots that get over a foot. We had one storm that went through last night, brought a lot of ice up across parts of New England. So it, most of that will likely have melted, but they don't have as easy of a day today because they're kind of cleaning up overnight. This is a storm right now bringing some snow across parts of uh, Illinois and in towards Indiana, and this moves through. It really gets going by tomorrow morning's commute and then throughout the afternoon. Most of it, well, for almost everybody, is going to be about a four to six hour snowstorm. The reason why this is important, if you get 6 to 10 inches of snow in a short amount of time. Yeah. The plows can't keep up with it. You can't keep your sidewalk shoveled and such. So I think a lot of kids tomorrow are going to be out of school. A lot of people having a harder time to get to work. So just be prepared for that. Uh, and you mentioned blizzard. You see that red there now right by Boston. Yep. Blizzard warnings, Cape Cod, the islands up towards Boston. Everybody else in this winter storm warning uh, and a solid swath here of a lot of people getting it up towards about a foot of snow. I was just looking at your weather tab on our, on our website and yep. it looks like for the big cities in the northeast corridor, especially New York, the worst of it starts about 4 or 5 in the morning, right through the heart of the commute. The morning commute. The tomorrow morning is going to be a rough one. If you can come in, actually not even late, if you can stay home, work from home, it's good. <laughs> Kids are probably going to be home. Uh, and it's done probably around 1 or 2 o'clock, but it stays cold at least through Friday. So we have, or it's good Friday is going to be a rough one on the roads as well. Then we warm up this weekend, and by Monday, most of it will be gone. The Fox and... Well, did you hear that, folks? By the weekend, it will warm back up. Now, I know this is the northeast part of the United States. I grew up here. I know the weather. I know the weather very, very, very well. But as this weatherman says, hey, we'll be back up to springtime temperatures and we're still in the first week of February. So once again, my point is, you can see very clearly that our weather patterns are so erratic, they've actually gone completely crazy. So folks, for anyone living in any of these areas, heed this warning. And be very, very careful. You may want to pick up some supplies tonight because this is supposed to begin throughout the middle of the night. Now, early in this uh, video, you saw the weatherman talking about a storm that went up through southwestern Pennsylvania, straight up through north Pennsylvania into the state of New York. And folks, I felt that storm last night. In the middle of the night, it was so loud. The rain came down so hard and there were rumbles of thunder that were almost a minute long. It sounded like you were in some type of a war with bombs going off around you. 
And this is very abnormal. Again, today where I live, it was 52 degrees, but it should have been about 25 degrees. So once again, the weird weather is going to continue. Anyone living in the northeast section of the United States, heed this warning. Make sure you're prepared. Thank you for watching the Nibiru channel. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Nibiru channel. It is February 8th, 2017. And coming out of nowhere, winter storm Nico, severe weather alert for the entire U.S. northeast coast. Temperatures set to drop up to 40 degrees overnight and bringing possibly 8 to 12 inches of snow in a matter of hours. I was just checking out a weather report on Fox News and I was actually checking weather conditions about eight hours ago and I heard absolutely nothing about this storm. And as I had expressed before, we're going to continue to have these very, very weird weather patterns. I mean,